Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I am filming something that might be a little surprising to you. This is my pink, sparkly, glittery, deco filled Pele Studio pastel crazy planner. And I love this planner. And let me kind of explain because you haven't seen a deco planner set up from me in a while. Planners like this used to be my main planner. But then I started planning a little bit more functionally, a little bit more minimally, and it totally changed my life. I don't think I could ever go back to spreads that were fully stickered. I mean, that was basically just memory keeping. I would fill my day in after it already happened. So I, was, I wasn't planning at all. I was basically just memory keeping. So ever since I started planning like pen only with like some transparent stickers, it has really changed my life. I've been so productive and so organized and I just could never go back. So I am really loving like the functional minimal kind of thing these days. It's, you know, just, it's working for me. I love it. I don't think I will ever stray from it. However, that being said, I do like, I love deco. I love pastel. I love cute things. Like that will never go away. That side of me will never go away. So I decided to set up this Chloe Leather Pele Studio um, in just a deco way and just as a fun planner to do whatever the hell I want. If I want to do memory keeping spreads, if I want to just, you know, journal, like whatever, I can do whatever I want in here. Um, I do also have some goal inserts, some cloth and paper goal inserts in here. So it's pretty much just my fun planner. That's all it is. I mean, I have like these, you know, more like minimal, stylish kind of pen only planners. I have a personal size for work, obviously pocket size for my main planner. And those are what I do real planning in. But this, this is a fun planner. So I thought I'd film a setup video anyways, just for any of you that may still love deco. I know minimal is all the rage right now, but just for fun. So these charms down here, um, the this one is from uh, XO Carolyn Designs, and then this one is from Kubo and Lucy. Super pretty. And just for the deets on my planner, so this is Pele Studio. This is the original regular Chloe leather. It's very cool toned baby pink with the baby shower glitter spine, which is like pastel pink, purple, and blue. It's got 30 millimeter rings, and it does have the like glittery pocket interior. I love it so much. I mean, it's freaking beautiful. I love neutrals, but bitch, I also love my pastels. So anyways, getting inside. Sorry about the glare. I got a new ring light tripod and like, okay, I love it because now I can film when it's cloudy out like today, but it does provide a glare. So I apologize. Um, so in the front pockets, and again, this is just going to be a purely creative deco setup. I will tell you where the deco's from. We're going to focus on that because the inserts are just, you know, they're fun. So this is a little die cut from Fox and Pip. This is also Fox and Pip. I just put it on like a business card that I got from a crystal shop. I put some of my favorite washi on this card. I love this from Simply Gilded. I have this little like kind of like LV inspired sticker sheet from Simply Watercolor Co. And then this um, washi card from Happy Scrappy. This front little dashboard, this 2020 dashboard is from um, Sparkly Peach Co. I love her dashboard so much. She sent me some amazing ones and I cannot wait to use them. I also have the 2021 and then she also just sent me some beautiful dashboards. You know what? My drawers right here. I'm going to show you because I love them. Where did they go? Here they are. And hopefully I can encourage you to go buy from Sparkly Peach Co. Because I love her. She's so sweet and her stuff is just incredible. Okay. Here's the 2021 dash. It's a little bit of a different pink. This one just says Amanda. Look at my fingerprints on it. I'm so sorry. This one says my Instagram handle, Amanda Lee Plans. I love this like Starbucks and hollow. This one says dog mom life, which is so cute. I have three dogs. Um, this is just like a rainbow says Amanda. And this is my favorite one. It's like vellum, little monstera leaf and it says vibes. So yeah, definitely check out Sparkly Peach Co. She has amazing stuff. So I have this layered over this kind of luxe like watercolor vellum from Sparkly Paper Co. And then this dashboard is a printable from XO Carolyn Designs. I printed it double-sided. So I printed this image on the front and then this one on the back. I love it so much. Um, this hollow luxe acetate is also Sparkly Paper Co. The, this like LV paper, I pretty much like found the pad, like background patterns on Pinterest. And then I just printed them as on cardstock as like scrapbook paper. Super cute. This uh, everything is energy. That was a freebie from a crystal shop that I shop with. This die cut is Sparkly Paper Co. And then on the back, I have this die cut from um, 
Aria's Daydream. And then that one is either Sparkly Paper Co. or Aria's Daydream. I can't really remember. This Amanda Lee Plans dashboard is from, I believe, Gigi Plannery. I think that's where I got that from Gigi. Um, I have the Gold uh, gold Lux Acetate from Sparkly Paper Co. And then this cute crystal dashboard from um, Little Magic Prints. I love that so much. Just some sticky notes from Sparkly Paper Co. Little uh, Grumpy Bear, or she's not Grumpy Bear, Bear Necessity Sticker Co. Die Cut. This right here is from Powder World. This is so cute. I love it. I just punched it in. And then these dividers, oh my gosh, I put like a hollow sticker on them. Oh, these are from Martha. Martha Plans, I think is her thing. Um, so I have a little hollow like Fox and Pippo. And then this is from Annie Plans, um, these covers and these inserts. Now I'm going to skip the first page because I did do a little journaling on that page. But I basically just have like various cute Annie Plans inserts in here. I just wanted to use all these cute notes pages. So I have some of the Lux ones. This is an acrylic tab from Fox and Pip. I have these little like skinnies, these little half things in like watercolor Lux. This is another like Lux collection insert. And then another Lux collection insert. I just, like I said, this cute stuff comes out. I wanna use it. I need somewhere to put it, but it doesn't really go with my main planner anymore. So. Here we are, we have set up a deco planner. This is paper from a Happy Scrappy kit. I think it was the March kit this year. Sadly, she's not doing kits anymore, um, but she'll still be coming out with products. This acetate is Sparkly Paper Co. And again, I have that layered over an Exo Carolyn Designs dashboard that I also printed double-sided. So that's on one side. And then this image is on the other. This is a dashboard from Catspresso Co. I love Catspresso. I have a code with them. It's Amanda10 for like to get these dashboards. So this little like image is from Powder World from one of their recent kits. I love it. And that is from Fox and Pip. And again, Powder World, Fox and Pip. Super cute. This Amanda, um, I guess like dashboard or acetate. It's a little thicker than regular acetate, but this is from Karen Sparkly Peach Co. again. This I Believe in Pink Drinks image was from Exo Carolyn Designs. I decided to print it on vellum and then I layered it over this Aria's Daydream dashboard. Like how freaking pretty is that? On the back, I have a rose colored Days Luxe pocket with just some die cuts, Sparkly Paper Co., um, Bear Necessities. I always want to say Grumpy Bear. This jelly paper, I can't remember where I got this. It was a long time ago when the, this like jelly stuff was all the rage. This boho rainbow I printed on vellum from Exo Carolyn Designs. Once again, this dashboard, the paint swatches, Exo Carolyn Designs, Bare Necessities die cut, and Exo Carolyn Designs. I love her stuff so much. This like LV inspired dashboard, I cannot remember where I got this. It's one of like, ugh, I know she has an Instagram shop and she does a lot of like LV inspired dashboards like this, but I cannot remember her handle for the life of me. I have this vellum from Fox and Pip another Bare Necessities die cut, and then, um, oh, I forgot to mention, I guess my first section is like notes, I guess. Like I said, I had all these notes pages. My second section is plan, because this is where I do my memory planning if I want to. So again, Annie Plans. Um, these inserts are from Annie Plans Printables, and I've only done two weeks of memory planning. Like I didn't do it last week. I just, the best part about these is I can just do it whenever I want. So these are a week on two pages. Um, this one was like missing the other page, but basically how it is, is you have like one big like notes page. And I love this kit. This Lux kit is from Simply Watercolor Co. It is so pretty and I'm so in love with it. Um, so yeah, there's like a notes page and then you've got Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So seriously, look how pretty this is. And it's like, ever since I started doing like minimal planning, like I still have deco kits that I don't want to just sit there and go to waste. So I figured like when I'm missing that, I can just, you know, come in here. And this is what the inserts look like without stickers on them. So it's like the magic collab, I think, with Aria's Daydream. But I use like washi to cover this up and stickers to cover that up. Even date covers. Um, and by the way, in pocket size, this is not the width of a standard full box. So I do have to cut my full boxes down. So I have a bunch of those inserts and then this is just a, um, I guess like dashboard that, or vision board that I made on Canva, printed so again, like a patterned paper on the back, Sparkly Paper Co, Fox and Pip. And then this is from Powder World. This is like a vellum and dashboard set. So this is what the vellum looks like. So beautiful. And then this is like the backing to it. Again, Powder World, that's from Happy Scrappy. This is, um, 
I cannot remember. This is like acetate and then like a vinyl that I put on it, but I don't remember where that's from. This is again, XO Carolyn Designs. And I put a pocket on the back with some stickers. I guess these are from Crafts by Towie. And then I have a Fox and Pip sampler and that's from Lace and Whimsy Studio. And this is Sparkly Paper Co. So cute. This rainbow dashboard, I believe is also from GG Plannery on Instagram. This is a pocket card from Carolyn that I just like printed double-sided. Some leopard sparkly paper co vellum, a vision board that I made myself um, ages ago. I love making vision boards. I feel like I'm going really fast and I feel like I also went really fast in my last video of like my main pocket planner. It's just hard because it's just like I'm just like rattling off where everything's from but hopefully I'm staying on one page enough for you to like see it I guess. Um, Fox and Pip, Powder World, this is one of my favorite vellums of all time. Like how good does this spot look? This is from Sparkly Paper Co. It's the colorful Lux. So pretty. And then my last sections are pretty much just like goals. I'm not going to show you because I did write in them. But I have the five-year plan inserts. I got them in a sub box. And I'm, you know, I don't need that in my main planner. For, that's like legit planning. So I figured I would put the goal inserts in here. So they come bro broken down in different sections. So this is the health and lifestyle. And then I think I also have the personal goals. It's like a five-year plan like goal setting inserts like i said i wrote in them so there's no way in fucking hell i'm showing them to the world um these are some notes pages again lux notes pages from any plans and then i've got some happy scrappy paper i love this paper it's just it makes me feel good it's such cute vibes um this at amanda lee plans acetate is from a shop that no longer exists this is uh exo carolyn designs like paint swatch dashboard i printed on vellum and then i just have this foxy fix dashboard with some little magic prints powder world fox and pip same powder world little magic prints fox and pip it's pretty much the same but like pink and purple this is one of my favorite dashboards ever it's like a vellum dashboard combo from aria's daydream how fucking pretty is that like i just love that sticky note from happy scrappy i love the way this looks i love this like watercolor tie-dye luxe that's from kina prince i just have again some of these like skinnies in here and this is the financial five-year plan so yeah financial five-year plan let's go to the end of that section and then that's from bare necessities on a happy scrappy paper more sparkly paper girl happy scrappy uh where's that from i think that's from the honey bee shop i actually really like the way this looks too it's some happy scrappy vellum over happy scrappy paper with this little fox and pip die cut really cute um i can't remember where that die cuts from i think it's frank cartio and then this i just have some these are die cuts from the honey bee shop i like the animal crossing one more lux vellum and then the very last section is yet another goal setting inserts more skinnies notes this is the professional five-year plan so pretty much like work stuff so let me skip past that i don't know if i wrote in the work one yet and then i just have this is from cat espresso co i have a bunch of stickers in here some like kina prints and some samplers and then i have this one with some fox and pip stickers i love these really cute this starbucks coffee thing is from red bubble i've had that for years so that's like on the fly leaf which is really hard to turn and then this was like a freebie from a crystal shop that i got a crystal from happy scrappy and then this like planner magic is sparkly paper co so yeah that is my deco fun planner i love to just like flip through it and just like look at it i mean i don't know it's like shops come out with so many cute things especially like exo carolyn designs it's like how am i not supposed to buy it how am i not supposed to use it so this has really been nice for me i mean i've got my neutral minimal planners for real planning and then i have this for fun planning i can do whatever the hell i want so it makes me very happy but yeah i hope you enjoyed that um and i am hoping to film a couple more videos today so be on the lookout for a lot more videos coming i know i haven't filmed in months but now that i have this ring light tripod i plan on filming a lot more so yeah i hope you enjoyed that have a great rest of your day bye